Hi, I'm Birchy, solar economics nerd and CEO of Open Solar. So let's talk numbers. In Australia today, the average seven kilowatt solar system with a seven kilowatt hour battery costs just 14,000 US dollars. That's $2 a watt. You can sell it on Tuesday and install it on Wednesday. There's no red tape, no permitting delays. The result, Aussies are saving more than 50% on their household energy bills. In just 10 years, solar penetration jumped from 7% to over 30% nationwide, and it's over 50% in many parts of the country. Now compare that to the US, where the same system averages $36,000, that's two and a half times more expensive. Permitting alone takes two to six months, and it doubles your team and operational costs. And now with net metering disappearing and Trump's latest move to phase out tax credit, despite the fact that fossil fuels still get it, it's gonna make solar 40% more expensive than grid power for consumers, if we don't act. But here's the thing, we don't have to rely on government crutches anymore. We already have the roadmap. We know we can cut US costs in half with four proven steps. Step one, automated permitting. That's why I co-founded Solar App, now approved across much of the US, and with your help, we can get it everywhere. With it, you can sell and install next day. No permitting delays, no OPEX, no headaches. An amazing customer experience. Step two, cut hardware costs. Start with a smaller battery. Keep it affordable today and we can scale the batteries later. Use better tools like OpenSolar to design and sell smarter and save five to 10% more from day one. Step three, lower customer acquisition costs. AI tools in lead management and design and sales can dramatically decrease the CAC. And with solar app, faster installs mean no cancellations and lower prices boost conversion and all of this together dramatically reduces your acquisition cost. And lastly, step four, we need to slash our overhead, automate payments, automate ordering, project management, all of that with open solar, drop unnecessary software spend, Plus, as the ITC goes away, financing gets simpler. Deal if fees shrink and capital costs will fall. So with all this, a lean local US solar business can sell at just $2.50 a watt with a battery. And that means homeowners can save 35% on their energy bills without a tax credit or even net metering. And that's how we can thrive and own our destiny over the next few years. And then, the gold run at the end is that tariffs get lifted in 2029, costs will drop to under $1.70 a watt. And that, I think, starts the real solar gold rush in the States, with customers saving 75% on their energy bills. It'll follow the Australian penetration growth. And in the States, that means 35 million homes and $300 billion in sales for solar professionals to customers over that decade. That's the future we need. So let's cut the costs. Let's own our future.